すげえ田舎ばっか旅してたせいかな。空間とは。Where? I'll get a cutscene. Liza? Liza, what are you sneaking around for? Oh well, I've been gone for a long time. It feels kind of weird just walking in. How does that make sense? You were also gone for a long time when you went to the capital, weren't you? Now that you mentioned it, that's right. Why was I sneaking around? It's your own place. There's no being uncomfortable with coming home. I kept your room clean, just so you know. Oh, you didn't move anything, did you? What, is something you don't want to have it moved? Ah, welcome home, Isa. Welcome home. Yeah, I'm home. Got plenty of souvenirs and stories to tell. Ah, <laughs> oh, sweet. Ah, I slept really well. Must have been really tired from travelling, but now I'm refreshed. Right then, I think I'll go check on everyone. In the meantime, until the ship arrives. Okay, next adventure. I'll go to quests. Can't do that. Yeah, I'm going to go back in my room and save a game here. Uh, this is a split episode, so the new episode's already started, so welcome back. But I might as well save again. I haven't actually saved yet today, so it's always a good point to start. Uh, that's where I ended last time, so let's start from here. Uh, unless you're just wandering around the island and speaking to everyone. You got one bear. Lent. Boss. Tau. Tau? And Federica? Okay. And again, I don't need to be around here, so I... Why are you here, Federica? Uh, uh, Claudia. Hi. Oh, a letter from your father. He left the caravans to you and is living comfortably in retirement now, right? You exaggerate too much. My father supervises the company's general operations back in hometown. I see, supervising general operations and managing, right? A letter says your mother's condition is stable, so don't worry. Before we met up, I sent him a letter saying I'll be working with Ryza for a while. Hey, you're always making... I'm a mark of making arrangements. He said your father's with her, but are you sure your mother's doing fine? We travel together, isn't that making it harder for you to see her? Don't worry, I know it's so... I know hearing about a condition makes it sound like a big deal, but... 
It hasn't changed that much over the years. Oh, I was with her. Thanks to you, Riza. You helped bring our family together again. Father and I became able to talk to each other about mother without hesitation. Now you're the one who's exaggerating. Even if I had helped you, you had the courage to change things. What's in your mind? Hey, why is that? I wonder if alchemy is really just about making stuff. I forget what I said. Just silly thought. I don't know what it is, but you can always talk to me. I know you quite well, Claudia. You're caring, thoughtful, reserved. But you speak up when things need saying, right? Yep. Yeah. yeah. Okay, next up we have. I'm actually going to zoom here. To a relaxing plaza. Apparently, you'll find Lent. I think I'm going to get, think I'm going to get fat from eating too many sweets. You're always busy running around, so those sweets won't hurt. Yes. One night has arrived by express mail from the capital. Please wait in the reception room while I bring it to you. Thank you. Oh, I didn't know you two were here. Hello, Tao. I heard about that. Exchanging letters with someone particular capital? Could it be a lovely Patricia, Tao? I think express mail for capital is probably from her. It's about time we see results. Results? As she came to send express mail, not to Paddy, but to another acquaintance. I talked to Bose about the term was in one book. So ask them to look up a dragon passage. It's okay, we're friends, right? Claudia, after we leave for our journey, many letters addressed to it get sent to Kirken Island. I'm never waiting for a letter. A delivery of your express mail. And here's a letter from the capital. Wow, what do you think, envelope? This can't be what we're just talking about. What's inside? It's on Patty. But could it be? You mean the results of what you're talking about? I suppose so. Huh. No, wait, it's both. Sorry, I I'm going home today. Oh, Tao. I tell you what, when Paddy joins, I'm going to be sport for choice as to who to you know, have him a party. After a reservoir? Hey, I suppose. Well, it's been a while since you two together. Riza. Yo! Lumber? I take it, must be glad to work with, work with Bose again after all these years. Oh, well, yeah, I suppose about all the changes that happened while he was gone. It's one better than him. Hmm. Hmm? What's up, Bose? You're staring at me. No, absolutely not. Never. What's that about? Any clues, Lumber? Uh, my own idea. You know Mr. Bullen doesn't want to let Bose go after he came back? Thinking about... I think it was about someone from Bluckstar? He's been trying to arrange a marriage with a young noble lady. Ah, he wants Bose to marry and settle down on the island. Not that easy being the son of an influential man. And Bo said no? 
He got bad bites. Now he's firmly refused, and Mr. Pudding got panicked and asked. You don't have your heart out of that stout girl, do you? That stout girl? Of course. Bowser zigged that element about the idea and said, no way, absolutely not. How dare you boast? What do you mean, no way? Absolutely not. I think it's not boast meant. Oh, character quest. More bows? What is it, Bose? You look awful tired. Is it because you just ch chased him, Riser? Oh, it's you, Riser. Nothing, I was just eating in a restaurant. That's nice. Not a good restaurant from a part of a village. Seems like it. I'm sure it was all good. Don't remember what it tastes like. Actually, I'm not even sure I ate anything to begin with. How can I enjoy a meal with a woman I've never met before talking about things I don't get? Really? For me, I wouldn't mind at all. I would totally enjoy it. I envy your happy go lucky personality. Look, Bose, stop trying to get in between her and Claudia. She's already got a wife. She needs a husband as well. What do you want? A high raiser. Need your help to make welcome me. What do you want? It's not going to gift woman like, apparently. What do you want? You want. Giant Kirken fruit, quality 50. And you want a Gnard ring of high quality. Can I make Gnard ring yet? <laughs> what are you two doing? Ha! <laughs> <laughs> Miss Bradshaw looks like he wants to have a serious conversation. You pet excuse your father never take anything seriously. You pretend not to know me when you came back and now you want to talk? Right back at you. I need some time to get my thoughts together. I told you I don't give a damn. Why do I have to stand here and listen to you? Despite everything, you are still my father. Stop, both of you. That's it. Which you can tell mystery old me, but I could have one one out of five times really tried. I said I wanted to have a serious conversation, but I'm not one who's actually gonna talk. I met her while travelling a little while ago. This is a letter from Mum. Yeah, it's been delivered. I'm already again soon with Riser and the other, so if you say, don't give a damn again, next time I'm back, I'll never forgive you. Riser, let's go. <laughs> Lent, I was very busy. Get out. Well, how goes the um, new place? Quite well, apparently. Pretty sure this leads to report. No, this one doesn't lead to report. No, I was just going to walk to a port. I don't know where character quest bear.
you know, I might as well walk there. And do it. Oh, chest. There's a chest around here somewhere. There it is. I'm sure exactly who that quest is going to be for. I might as well go and do it. It's a character quest for ba -ba -da -bam, Claudia. Oh, remind me, Mr. Brunner is bringing up matchmaking talk with both, I heard. Being born in a powerful house is no end of trouble. That's how it is. I've had similar offers brought to me. Really? You too, Claudia? Are they trying to break these two up? And again, it wouldn't surprise me. No real surprise. I mean, you're quite a catch. What happened? I turned them down. I think you know this, but my work. It's fulfilling, very busy, high priority. It's just a personal thought of mine. I don't think it's true you've got to get married. But a lot of women in the world live by themselves, right? And others will live with other girlfriends. Such a grown up, Claudia. Really, though, it's because I want to keep adventuring with you, Visor. There we are. That's the marriage proposal if ever I heard one. These two wonderful flatmates. There's a treasure chest out here. There it is. Oh, behive. Always oh, one up here as well. You know what? I might as well just get these chests while I'm here. No harm in it. Oh, nothing else up here. But apparently, there's one between Wise's house and the port. Nothing there. Nothing there. So I'm going to head back home. I'm going to get one between Wiser's house and Fresher. And then I'm going to get the next um, part of this quest next episode. So again, thanks so much for watching, guys. Have a wonderful day and bye-bye.